I'm on page 225 of your statistical function stage 2. In this stage we're going to add further calculations to the expenses spreadsheet. We're going to insert two rows between 1 and 2. So I'm going to go to number 2. As I want two rows, highlight 2 and 3, right click, insert. I want to make sure that the font size of row 3 is 11. So I'm going to click on row 3, go to home and choose 11. I now want to maintain A3 max. I want it in bold and italics as well as being right aligned. So I'm going to do my formatting first, right, bold, italics, and then I'm going to type max. In B3 I want to enter a formula to calculate the maximum figure for all the monthly figures using the max function. So I could either type equals max, open bracket, or I could use the max function near auto sum. As I want to find the highest figure from all my months, I'll click from B6 all the way to G13, press enter, and it's displayed 60,000. In cell C3, I want to enter min, bold, italics, and right aligned. So right aligned, bold, italics, min. I now want to enter a formula using the same figures from January to June to find the lowest figure. So I'm going to go to auto sum, min, select my data range, and then press enter. In E3, I want to enter count row 10, bold italics, wrap the words and align it to the left. So I'm going to do my formatting first. So to the left, bold italics, and I'm going to type my text. Count row 10, close brackets. But I want that wrapped. So if I click on the text, click on wrap, and there I have it, it's done it for me. In F3, I want to enter a formula to calculate how many numerical month values there are in the data column B to G, row 10. But I want to use the count function. So I'm going to click on the drop down and use count numbers. As I want to count row B a row 10 for B to G, I will select row 10, B to G, and press enter. You'll see that it's counted 5. This is because it will only count the cells with values in it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. As there's no value there, it will not count it. We need to save our spreadsheet, keeping the same name, and this stage is now complete.